welcome back to the channel this is z and i'm coming today to give you guys a collective read um when i say collective it's for all signs so i don't know who it's gonna resonate for but i haven't done one of these in a while on my channel but since we are growing growing um i want to give you guys like bonus readings basically so yeah it's just like whatever comes up could be just like a message that somebody needs to hear that type of thing so yeah I'm going to use my Daily Vibes Oracle deck. I am still having a sale, y'all, if you are interested in a read. It's $30 now um, for the spread readings that I do offer. So you can get a current energy reading, a finances and career, which is like a money read. I asked about the energy surrounding your finances and your career. Uh, with a singles love reading, which is like a new love reading. Um, specific person love reading, if you are dealing with someone or if like you're in a connection, you could be unsure about the person. Or you're trying to figure out like what's going on that type of thing yeah um they are all very helpful and insightful as well so yeah if you want to book one you can email me or use the link to submit your info to my site if you do get the error or whatever just press click here so let's see what comes up let me know if you guys want more readings like this i used to do them but then i stopped because like I just feel like nobody won't really <laughs> looking at them or whatever, but yeah. Let's see here. What messages do you have for the collective? What messages do you have for all signs? Okay, so we got a new cycle that showed up here. So there's some new energy showing up here, okay. So it does say welcome in the new. Some of you guys are need to have faith here about a new start, a new, I said a new circle, what in the world? A new cycle starting. It's like maybe you feel like something's holding you back or something from starting a new cycle or like having like a new beginning basically. But have faith about it um, and just trust in divine timing. Okay, what other messages do you have for the collective all signs? What messages do you have for all signs? Yeah, and as I said divine timing y'all, it showed up. My card, Divine Timing, is perfect. Just know that, like, everything's happening the way it's supposed to be happening. Even if you feel like it should have started, like, yesterday. Or, like, maybe you feel like you should have got something, like, yesterday. It's going to come in a perfect timing. What messages do you have for um, all signs? And also, so you could be feeling like something's wrong with you, too, as to where you haven't really received something. But no, it's saying, like, you look good, like, you're doing good, so don't feel like it's, it's you. What messages do you have for all signs? Yeah, good news. Okay. Good news. So some of you guys could definitely get some new good news here. It could be like an email. Um, I don't feel like it could be like a letter. Now it could just be like an email, like something online to where it's like good news for you. Good news is coming in in the perfect timing. This is like a new cycle for someone. And it does look like, hey, it's definitely going to brighten up your day. We got sunny day that showed up here. Some of you guys are needed to watch your mouth too. Watch your mouth. Be careful with the words that you speak because it's like you could be definitely thinking um, or like speaking ill about yourself too. Because um, my card, take a look in the mirror. I seen that when the divine timing card was showed up. So it just feels like it just feels like self doubt. But you know, self doubt could be like the words that you speak. You could be like, oh, I'm not really that good at this, or. Um, like maybe it's me to where this hasn't came in yet. It's not you. So um, think positive about yourself and don't speak ill about yourself or like speak down about yourself too. What message is there for all signs? What message is there for all signs? Yes, we got light bulb that showed up here. It looks like you are going to get some clarity here, some insight when this good news shows up. It looks like it could definitely be an opportunity for someone because my card opportunity showed up. I'm going to pull one more because I wasn't expecting that light bulb card to pull up, um, to pop out. Give me one more for all signs. Uh -oh. Give me one more card for all signs. Yeah, so we got cloudy day. 
and guess what's at the bottom of the deck y'all so it's letting you know that some things are going to be changing about your situation if this is resonating with you so far so like with this cloudy day we already seen sunny day right so it's like you're coming out of this cloudy day that's showing up here and look big change some of you guys are trying to manifest something right and you could be like because it has not came in yet just know that it's gonna happen in divine timing you could be feeling like something's wrong with you or like you're doing something wrong but that's not the case so yeah big change showed up here at the bottom of the deck so it's letting you know that hey the clouds are going to disappear the sun is going to come out so let's see i'm gonna um Okay, yeah, I'm going to use my Rider weight deck. So we're going to start off with New Cycle. To see what this is about. Tell me about New Cycle for all signs. So we got the Six of Cups that showed up here. Now, it looks like it could be some past energy showing up here. But um, let's get one more. Tell me about New Cycle for the collective. Well, for all signs. Yeah, so we got Ace of Pentacles that showed up here. Some of you guys are definitely, okay, so I see why that Six of Cups that showed up. Because I'm like, okay, we talking about something new. But then a Six of Cups showed up, which is like past energy. You guys have something coming in here. This looks like it's an opportunity for someone. Know that it's something tangible, especially with the pentacles. It's like something that you can actually touch, see. But it looks like this is the new cycle for someone. But it looks like you guys could be needing to like release and cut. Ooh, we got the king and queen of pentacles. So it's a major cutoff season. <laughs> okay, like. Some of you guys could definitely need to cut off some people, right? Like release some pe uh, some people here. It looks like some past energy that's showing up with the Six of Cups. Give me one more for new cycle. Yeah. So it does like some things are going to be changing here. Um, some of you guys have some definitely some like life changing events that's going to be happening here with this death card that's what i feel but it's like um the past energy cannot enter into this like new cycle it says the welcome in the new but when the six of cups showed up here that's like past energy it's like it's time to let that go cut it off so let's see what divine timing is clarify divine timing for all signs Clarify divine timing. Yes, yeah, so we have a two of pentacles that showed up here. So for some of you guys, it does look like um, ooh, okay, y'all. Look, the way this show up, I'm about to show y'all. Some of you guys are about to find balance. Now I do feel like too, I feel like this is about someone's like um finances. Some of you guys could have definitely been like juggling here or like needing balance in regards to like your finances. It does like you could have had some problems with finances. Something new is coming in to where it's like you're going to be able to um, to stop like juggling. Now, if you do work more than one job or it's like you're going through some type of financial constraints, it's like the waters are, are very rocky here in the background with this two of pentacles. This Ace of Pentacles coming in here in divine timing to where um, it's going to help you balance some things out. Tell me more about divine timing. It's perfect for the for all signs. Tell me about divine timing for all signs. Yeah. So we got the Ten of Swords that showed up. So it looks like this is going to be an end to, like in divine time, it's going to be an end to someone's like financial um, constraints or like you could have just been struggling financially. Tell me about good news for all signs. Yeah, look, the full card showed up here. So this is like a new beginning for someone, a new start. 
but I do feel like for some of y'all, you need to like you need to trust yourself and don't have any type of self doubt about your appearance. I don't know why I feel that with the full card because like you see how his his dress is like different. But I feel like like about someone's like clothing or something. It's like maybe you feel like you don't have the right clothes or like the appearance for whatever this good news is. It's like something new showing up for someone. And I do feel like someone's like used to being in this like two of pentacles type of energy too. Like you used to doing this. So let's see what else comes up here. Tell me more about good news for all signs. What's this? Yeah, Page of Cups. So it looks like you guys are definitely going to be getting some, um, it's like surprising insight here in regards to um, a new beginning here, a new start. Something that you could have been like waiting for, but it's like maybe you just ask, it's like maybe you asked the universe for it, but you didn't really um, know how it was going to come in. It's just like you just wanted that situation to change. Um, but it looks like it's coming in here for someone. Tell me about light bulb. Okay, so we got the lowest card that showed up here. Oh, y'all. I was not feeling anything romantic. This is about some people. Like whenever this this um this ace of pentacles shows up, I'm gonna use my Kipper deck. I got it out to clear about his ace of pentacles. Some of y'all gonna really have to, it's like you going about you about to get some insight here on like how people really um feel about you with the lover's card. It's like this could be like friendships or it could also be like relationships too. Whatever this is, this good news is it's causing some type of conflict or like some drama. And it's almost like you're going to have to, like, defend yourself or, like, um, stand your ground. Like, don't back down. Because something is changing here with someone's finances. I'm going to clarify a big change. Tell me about big change for all signs. Yeah, look, three of wands. You guys have definitely been waiting for your ships to come in here. There's some type of opportunity that's showing up. It's like you don't really even know. It's almost like you really don't even care how to come in. Like you've been waiting for your situation to change, okay? Big change showing up here. The page of wands showing up here. It looks like you guys are going to be getting some good news here or communication that's showing up, but it's coming in in divine timing. Give me one more for big change for the for all signs. Let me stop saying that. <laughs> I keep meaning to say all signs, but I keep saying like collective. So we got the nine of swords that showed up here. Some of y'all are definitely like you have fear surrounding finances. That's what's showing up. But look, we got the Wheel of Fortune card that's showing up. At the bottom of the deck, when that, that nine of swords showed up, it wanted to pop out, so I just let it pop out. Um but yeah, it looks like positive change happening and it is going to be like wish fulfillment for someone. Like you're going to be happy um, when it's change comes in. Tell me more about big change for all signs. Um, also change the way you're thinking too. I kind of mentioned it in the beginning. Because it feels like self-doubt or just like someone thinking that like you're not good enough or you just feeling like maybe you can do more, but you're already doing like whatever you can. Um, so it's like putting putting it all into the divine, like the universe hands, basically. Tell me more about big change for okay, so this could be new love for someone here. We got the ace of cups that showed up. It could be new love, y'all, but this could also be like divine inspiration. Um, with this Ace of Cups showing up. It could be like a new partnership for someone. And it could be to where like there's going to be big change in someone's love life because we do have the Lover's card that showed up. 
But um, it looks like whatever the situation is, it's like going to, um, it's definitely going to give you like a lot of clarity or like insight on um, other people around you. The way it's showing up here. How many minutes? 15 minutes. So let's get my Kipper deck real quick. We about to get some insight on this Ace of Pentacles. Clarify the Ace of Pentacles for all signs. Clarify the Ace of Pentacles for all signs. What's this? Okay, so mature man. Somebody could be getting some money here from a mature man. Like an older male figure, y'all. <laughs> mature man. But it's like a past energy, so I'm not really sure. Since this is like general, y'all, I don't know. It could be like a mature man. But it is card number five, which is crazy. So, like, something's definitely changing with someone's finances. Now, this opportunity could be coming in um, from a mature man, like an older male or just someone who's, like, mature. Tell me more about Ace of Pentacles for all signs. Yeah, so we got thoughts that showed up here. So we got thoughts. Someone's thinking about an opportunity or it's almost like someone's thinking about giving someone um, something here. I'm trying to figure out what it is. What is this Ace of Pentacles for all signs? Yeah, it's money. Sudden wealth. I had a feeling it was like money. And it could be in regards to like a um, partnership or a relationship for someone. But yeah, it's money showing up. Tell me more about this Ace of Pentacles here. Tell me more about Ace of Pentacles. Yeah, message. Some of you guys are about to get a message. And I feel like this is like the good news that's showing up as well. Some of y'all could be seeing um, Sevens because that's showing up in the read too. It showed up. This sudden wealth card has Sevens on it. It's almost like you're hitting a jackpot. Um, and in this card, thoughts is seven two. Well, it's sixteen, like six plus one is seven, and in this message card is seven. Tell me about good news for the for all signs. <laughs> Tell me about good news for all signs. Yeah, we got official person. Some of you guys are about to get a message about something that you're concerned about. It's money, y'all. It's money. It's coming in from, could possibly be like an official person here. Tell me more about good news. It seems like that's the mature man. Yeah, we got house and courtship keeps showing up. It could be a new relationship or partnership for someone. This could also be like a work situation too. But yeah, we got house that showed up. Someone could be coming to someone's like home or their house. It looks like some of you guys could be getting good news here in regards to like a living situation too or like a home situation. Um, but it's like dealing with finances or like money. Tell me more. Um, tell me about divine timing for all signs. Yeah, we got imprisonment that showed up. So get out of your head here with this imprisonment card. I kind of read it as like a mental type of thing with this imprisonment because it's coming in with divine timing. Like just know that you're going to receive some good news um, concerning your situation and divine timing. That's going to really change some things for you. So look, message of concern keeps showing up. Tell me more about big change. I'm going to use my um, priestess. Oh, it could definitely be in regards to someone's like work too or like your occupation. So it looks like something's changing with someone's like work or occupation. This could be like a new job opportunity y'all too. But it kind of feels like a new venture for someone. 
Like they're, they're gonna be starting something new, but then it's like, you could be feeling like you're not good enough or like you're not ready for whatever this is. And I feel like it's more so about someone's like appearance too. That's what it looks like for some people. I'm gonna see what um, big change is. No, actually good news. Tell me about good news for all signs. Tell me about good news for all signs. Okay, that was not the card that was supposed to come up. Tell me about good news for all signs. I like to wait for the cards to pop out. Tell me about good news. So we got sacred. We got sacred action. I heard some like blowing noise. Sacred action, um, decisive focus. So look, it looks like for some of y'all, once you get this good news here, it does look like um, it's like a lot of action here going on. And also to like movement, but it's in regards to like new creations, like a new, a new cycle here. And you could be feeling like you're, like you're stuck or like stagnant. Or maybe you feel like things aren't really moving forward in your situation. Give me one more for good news. So we got opening hearts that showed up. I got a hair band in this before my camera cut off. But yeah, opening heart, deep connections, water blessings. So yeah, it looks like for some of you guys, this could be like a deep connection um, for someone as well, like in regards to like a romantic situation. Give me one for big change. Hopefully my camera don't cut off. Give me one for big change. Give me one for big change for all signs. Okay, we got Divine Masculine that showed up here. Electric active power that's showing up. So with this big change, it could be like someone's, um, like a male energy, that's what's showing up. It's like a male energy is showing up here in regards to someone's situation. It's like something dealing with finances, y'all. That's what it looks like. Tell me more about big change. Tell me more about big change. Tell me more about big change. Okay, I don't know why. So we have circle of eternal joy. I feel like a three of cups energy with this. Um, Cause this is dance of life, but then it says like timelessness. So yeah, and on my card, my divine timing card, I never uh, mentioned it. Well, I have mentioned it before in other readings, but it says, but time is an illusion. You know how they say like time is an illusion. Try not to think too hard about it, but like, that's what it is. Um, and it, yeah, it looks like for some of y'all, you're gonna be celebrating some big changes that's happening um that's showing up here it's like surrounding finances or like something that you could be like concerned about so it could be like a job situation too but i'm gonna leave the read here if you made it this far thank you so much um of course my camera cut off towards the end when i was like trying to close out the read so yeah if you made it this far thank you and if you want to leave a comment below um let me know if it resonated with you and if you are new here or just discovering my channel from this video then feel free to subscribe as well